I'm Jesse, and this is my scandalous story. It was uh, my 23rd birthday, and I lived above this seedy, really nasty bar, and we had two roommates there. And the one room was me and my best friend. We shared a big room, and it was separated by a couple mirrors and a mirror for our privacy that we had. And on this evening, you know, like I said, it was a birthday party there. Everybody's hanging out upstairs, downstairs, all over the place. And one girl that I had been talking to for a little bit, just, uh, you know, friends here and there, a little extra, stuff like that. No names, no labels or anything. Real gorgeous, tall, skinny, redhead, just great girl, great personality. She would run off here and there, I'd do my thing. We never had hard feelings, and this particular evening on my birthday, she was, I just lost track of her for hours on end, and I just figured she went off and she was taking care of her thing, and whatever, no big deal, wasn't upset. And uh, getting close to the end of the evening there, a uh, good friend of mine, this other girl, really, really short, just cute little, chipmunk looking kind of girl, just adorable little thing. She came and she started apologizing to me how she didn't bring a birthday present. She didn't realize it was my birthday. But if I wanted to go upstairs, she'd make it up to me with her own little birthday present. And uh, you know, considering it was the end of the evening, been drinking and all, I wasn't gonna turn down a birthday present. So we go upstairs and go in and whenever she gives me my birthday present, actually she gave me two birthday presents that night. Well, we both wound up pretty much passing out, falling asleep for a few hours, and I woke up and just saw my bedroom door opening up, a little light shining through, and I just saw a tall, skinny silhouette come walking into the room, and I knew right away what was going on. And sure enough, the girl came, and she sat down on the edge of my bed and started taking her shoes off, and I did what any guy would do, I would assume, just froze up and played possum, acted like I was sleeping, hoping it would all go away, but sure enough, it did not. She proceeded to take her pants off, shirt off, climbs under the covers with me, and, you know, starts rubbing all my chest and everything. She starts rolling over and straddling over me, and as she does that, her hand bumps into the girl lying next to me, and she, I guess, pretty much right away knew what was going on, so pretty much just as quietly as she climbed into the bed, she rolled over and slid out of bed and put her pants back on and her shirt back on and grabbed her shoes and just, quiet as can be, walked out of the room and left, didn't cause a scene or anything, so I figured it was all fine and that was the end of it, but not so much. About an hour later, my roommate, my best friend, he comes walking back into the room with this tall, skinny silhouette on his arm, and he takes her to his side of the room, and they go and make their beautiful music together that evening. And that was pretty much the end of my great birthday party and my scandalous story.